breaking news from WDSU. And first at four, we are following breaking news. The Orleans Parish Coroner's Office has reclassified the death of Henry Glover as a homicide. For the past year, Glover's family has been asking the coroner's office to rule the death a homicide. WDSU anchor Gina Swanson joins us live now at four o'clock from the news desk in the newsroom with the late breaking developments from the coroner's office. Gina. That's right, Camille. This is one of those cases after Hurricane Katrina that people held up as a as an example of police brutality. At first, Henry Glover shot at the hands of a New Orleans police officer, David Warren, in Algiers. Glover was then brought to a nearby school for aid. Days later, his body found in a burned out car on the side of the levee. Five officers were initially accused in this case. Three were found guilty back in 2010. Since that time, the conviction of David Warren has been overturned. He was granted a new trial, then acquitted. Greg McRae was convicted of burning Glover's body, and Officer Travis McKay was also convicted, but that was eventually tossed out. Now, for a long time, the Glover family has pressed the coroner to classify Glover's death a homicide. Though it's not clear what has changed in this case or what new evidence exists to now make this determination. And just because the death has now been classified a homicide, that doesn't necessarily mean that there will be more court proceedings to follow, even though that's what Glover's family certainly has been pressing for. We have reached out to them, and we will bring you more on later newscasts. But for now, we're live in the newsroom. I'm Dina Swanson. Back to you. All right, Gina, with that breaking news, and former NOPD officer uh, David Warren was convicted in 2010 for shooting and killing Glover and was granted a new trial and acquitted at that trial in 2013. His lawyer, Rick Simmons, says they have questions about the timing of today's announcement and what new evidence, if any, the coroner is using. 